Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Happy Friday. I am here today with a longer vlog and basically organizing, cleaning the house because after the girls party, it obviously was a little messy in our house. So I just thought I'd kind of take you guys through organizing for the last few days I've been organizing. So lots of fun stuff and also getting into fall, I brought out like lots of little fall decor pieces and stuff. I still have lots to do and just decorating in general. So I'm really excited. I'm gonna try to do a home sense trip maybe sometime this weekend. I also got fall ready with you. So my fall makeup look I did in today's vlog too. Um, but if you guys have not yet subscribed, definitely subscribe now, join the fam. Also, I apologize, Ryan is mowing the lawn right now. There's like never a good time to film, but just bear with me. Uh, but I hope you guys had an awesome week and thank you so much for all the love on the girl's second birthday video. I'm so happy that you guys loved it and just thought it was such a magical celebration. So I really appreciate all the love and support on that video. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Let's roll right in. Good morning. Mm, is that yum yum? Mm -hmm. Mommy have some? Mommy have some? Good morning, you guys. So my allergies are so bad this morning. I apologize, but it's starting to get colder. And I don't know if I've said this in my videos before. I think I have, but I have a humidity change um, allergy, which is pretty crazy. Um, but like the temperature when I go from hot to cold, I sneeze like crazy. And I actually went to like a allergy specialist and it is an actual thing, which is nuts. But <laughs> anyways, I, yeah, my allergies are really bad right now. Uh, but forever nuts. This has been one of my favorite teas. So I'm gonna make this and this is like the most addicting tea ever It's so good and I just I love getting David's tea when it's on sale. So I got these for eight dollars um, usually they're 12 but So worth it. I love these for fall. I think I'm gonna be getting into tea season uh, I'm gonna get hot water There we go Look how pretty that tea is. It's a really nice fall color, so I've just been addicted. I've been having one of these a day, and it's so nice for fall. I'm really into tea season right now, and speaking of tea. So the other thing I wanted to do in today's vlog, I need to organize our coffee bar. Like, look at this. And I wanna decorate up there, put some things, pretty things up there, and uh, we have tea, coffee, wine, and liquor up here. So I definitely need to organize that. And the mug situation as well is a little insane right now, so um, I definitely wanna organize all these with you. And we put like our fancier mugs in that area, but I just thought I would do that with you today because now that we're getting into fall, I definitely have a lot of tea and coffee, as you guys know. And then also our mud room here is a little messy, so. Yeah, there's just some diaper bags over there and just things, but I did get a few things in the mail, so I'll show you guys that as well in a minute. Um, but yeah, we're in this section every day and we're big coffee drinkers. Ryan probably has about three a day. I do about one to two, um, but yeah, time to organize. And I was thinking up here I could put candles, maybe some like really cute little knickknacks and decor and then candles might look nice so it's actually pretty dark outside right now for morning we're kind of getting into the fall weather um so i just turned our chandeliers on there's so many dishes and i told ryan i'm like don't touch them because i wanted to vlog and kind of do like a tidy clean with me for fall um so i'm gonna be doing that in a minute but i just got this in the mail so you guys know in my last video my spinning organizer broke i got this one instead which i really really do like this one and it's very sturdy and i just think it's really nice like it looks really simple but elegant so you can put skincare on top um, and then on the bottom as well you could even do like hair products because they're tall this thing is taller so that worked out really well and then obviously um, my pumpkin situation here this is my only decor which is pretty sad uh, but I need to go get my other fall stuff we kind of like all our Christmas stuffs together but for fall I didn't have as much so I kind of mixed it with other boxes so it's it might take me a little bit of time to find that today but I definitely am really excited to put some fall decor out also I have my little Estee Lauder makeup bag I've actually been using this a lot and I took 
took this out and I started using it the other day. It's so pretty for fall. It's one of their eyeshadow sticks, Pixie. So we have that, which I've been going in with a lot. I have my Pat McGrath foundation, all time fave. Um, there's just some random makeup that I've just honestly been using 24 seven. And I got my gold brushes in here for fall, my favorite. Oh, so pretty. Love those. And my powder brush. Um, so I've got all those. I have my Tom Ford highlighter. And I've just been honestly going in with the same makeup. And everyone's been asking me about my fall makeup looks because I've been going more dramatic. And you guys are probably not used to seeing that. So I think I'll do a get ready with me and not my next vlog but after that i'm gonna do like a a fall um i'm just waiting for fall outfits actually so i'm placing an order for like big cozy sweaters and things that you may like um so really excited for that and that'll be in not next week but the following week So little break on the fall decor. I wanted to quickly get all my marble glam sets away and I usually like having, hi Maxi, some at home stock just because I do a lot of giveaways and um, I need them for photos. So I have lots of new sets here before the launch, which I'm so excited about. So I want to get all these put away in my office. Also, I'm working on <sighs> this. So I want to get all of my like office situated and just like get over it or get rid of all the stuff I had for the girls party and put it into a box and just get everything organized in here. Good thing I did not do my makeup today because I am burning a sweat but I just wanted to quickly show you what this looks like. I actually changed it the opposite way so I can see the set name. So we have Marble Glam and Pink Mini set and then once I get the other ones in it'll be easy to see as well but I just think they look so organized in there so I'm really happy about that. Good morning, you guys. It is day two of vlogging. So I have just been doing laundry this morning. Uh, Ryan's with the girls right now while I finish up some work. I have a Zoom meeting at noon and then I actually have a podcast that I'm doing later today. Um, a girlfriend's friend actually started a podcast. So that will be cool. That'll be later. And then, um, yeah, just a busy day in between. I definitely have a lot of organizing and cleaning to do, as you know. Um, so I wanted to do the coffee bar in my office. I wanted to get my skincare up in the new um, organizer that I got. And then the other thing, you guys remember when I made these, their first little holiday card. So I definitely actually want to make new ones and get those prepped. And I might even do Thanksgiving ones, but we will see. I'm also organizing all my brushes for some special photos that I'll be taking. Oh my goodness. <gasps> So beautiful, I can't get over it. And I'm gonna put some upstairs, I'm gonna put some in my closet, I'm gonna put some in my office, just a little bit everywhere. Um, I might even put it in that little nook area off the kitchen. I think they would just look really pretty because they match the kitchen. Um, but yeah, I have my little step stool out so I can reach my top shelves today. Just lots of organizing. I think we're gonna do the podcast in here, so I de definitely need to organize a little bit. <laughs> All right, so I put all my frames up at the very top and I just kind of put random ones there of the girls um, from our wedding and then I'm also taking down all this stuff. So uh, we have lots of like headbands uh, from the party and then also these little flowers that were outside. So I want to get like a little second birthday bin and just get everything stored away where like our Christmas and like our holiday stuff is and then I can start having a nice clean office. <laughs> 
Okay, so I've collected all Mia and Sophia's new shoes. They are going upstairs and I just finished off this side and I apologize, I wish I could show you like all the organizing, but sometimes, and I'm really cut for time right now, um, I don't have the time. So instead of stressing myself out, I am just going to show you guys what it looks like after it's finished. <laughs> so this is what I have so far on this side here. Um, I'm gonna put something in the middle there, but we have some new sets and file folders and things like that and wow it is so bright in here right now and then on this side which i really like i use this container i had from the girls party and i put like all my brushes in here so this is just ones that i haven't used yet great for photos and stuff like that i have all my thank you cards on this side just in this little tray and also right here i put all my chat books so i do have a few more upstairs that i have to grab but i just thought that would be a nice little area and i have some like um, office supplies as well, which I'm gonna be doing an office supplies haul off Amazon, so that's coming soon. I found some really nice containers um, for in here, so that'll be nice. So this room also has to be cleaned, and I haven't touched it since we did our photo shoot with Nomo. Uh, so we, <laughs> there's stuff everywhere. There's beanies, clothes. Um, I actually like how she put the tent in here from the girls' party, so I think I'm gonna leave that in here and just keep the rugs and the little unicorns and stuff. Oh, we have all my new products over there that they were playing with. So I definitely will clean this a little bit later today, but this is from Amazon. So if you guys are interested in it, it's probably one of the nicest pieces that I've ever bought them. And it was pretty affordable as well. Um, super pretty. So yeah, my shoes are in here too. These are the ones that I wore just for photos. I can't actually wear these outside or else I'd like break my face. Um, they're so uncomfortable and tall, but they're cute for photos, so I do have those in there. Uh, doing laundry right now, and then in the girls' cribs, um, we just did some laundry actually, like their sleep sacks and stuff, but I have their new stuff here that I wanna get put away, and I think I'm gonna transition all of their summer clothes into winter and just hang them. It's a little easier for us to just grab things. And they got these little backpacks for their birthday. They're so cute, so they're just gonna go right there for now, and then I'm just gonna take their shoes out. They got so many new shoes and they actually only had one pair of shoes so that really helped me out and these are just the cutest little vans i got them these uh little booties i thought they'd be nice and then my mom got these ones here those are really cute too okay so their little shoe collection is done that's all they have right now but i'm thinking about getting them some really cute comfortable uggs too i really like the ones they had when they were younger but obviously they can't fit into those now yep so just thought i would show you what's going on right now look at all that laundry like this is us 24 seven. Um, so I'm gonna do some laundry, fold some clothes, and then I'm gonna do my skincare. Okay, so I just put my sweaters away and hung everything up. And once I get my new haul in, I definitely am gonna be ordering some new like cozy sweaters and stuff. I will do like a full try on haul cause I love fall outfits. Um, and clearly you guys know I like my neutrals, but I'm really, really excited to just do fall shopping. And hopefully I can hit up Home Sense too cause I wanted to get some new fall decor. Good morning, you guys. So it is actually the next day. And I had the podcast yesterday and it was so, so much fun. I actually posted like a little thing on my Instagram. So I've never actually been on a podcast. So once it comes out in October, you guys will have to take a listen. Uh, I'm a little tired. We had some of the kitchen people come here today and yeah, it's just always so busy in the morning. And then I actually have um, a company that's kind of revamping my website. So I'm really excited and I'm getting ready for the, the marble set to launch. So my photographer Aaron is working on these right now and I'm so excited, but I wanted to use them today and get ready with you guys and I apologize for the little hickey on my neck. <laughs> uh, Ryan. Um, yeah. Anyways, I had to cover it up with makeup yesterday. That's just the mama life I'm living, but I've got all my makeup in here right now. I have the new Patrick to She's Thursday. So this is actually really nice if you want like a little bit of a glow. It's just a beautiful mist. It smells so good. 
So I'm going in with a little bit of that. Uh, the wake up balm, this is really nice too. And my hair's a little crazy this morning. I just have it in a ponytail, but anytime I wear a wig, my hair goes like really flat. Uh, but I wore my wig yesterday, my brown one. And uh, what I was just saying, I'm going in with the wake up balm. I need a little bit of this on my face. It's like a primer by Estee Lauder. Ooh. And I wanted to do that fall look that I keep doing. And I got so many questions on like that look. So I'm really excited to just do that. And it's my, been my go-to fall look. Uh, you know what I've been using is this. The Pixie, what is it called? Copper Glaze. So her little eyeshadow sticks, this is honestly key. This is like the most gorgeous fall color. Like, look at that. There's my terrible swatch. But that's what that looks like there. So I put that on my eyes and I just love it. It's such like a, like a warm, bronzy color for fall. And then I'm gonna go in with all my new brushes. So this is all you need, honestly. I love this set so much. So let's start with this. So I just put it all over my lid. And I thought I would mention I have my first mom's night out on Saturday with three other moms, including one of my really great friends, Tina, that just moved here. So I'm really excited. I have not had like a mom's day out in so long. So we're just gonna go for a nice dinner, have happy hour, and we're gonna get ready at the house together. And then Ryan, actually Ben's coming uh, with Michael. So their baby's gonna stay here. We're gonna do like a big sleep over here. Uh, so it'll be fun and the guys can hang out. I'm so tired this morning. Uh, I'm just blending that out. Okay. And depending on how long I take to do this makeup, I might fast forward some scenes, but we'll leave the scene. And I've got, okay, so I've been going in with this, the Bronze and Glow. I love this color for the crease. This is like the perfect color. So this is Natasha Denona. I love it. I'm gonna use my big fluffy blender. Love it. <laughs> I love these brushes so much. This is definitely my favorite set right now. I cannot wait for these bad boys to launch. The bristles are so soft, you guys. Like, oh. Whole new level. I have not gone to Home Sense either. I'm really <laughs> wanting to get some. I'll show you what I did yesterday. I'm done my dining room table and I definitely need some more fall decor. I put this really big like planter outside, very fall, very pretty, but I feel like inside we're kind of slacking. Besides my office, I have lots of fall stuff in my office, but the rest of the house has not been done, so. Um, I don't like to buy a whole new amount of stuff because I still have so much stuff from last year, but I feel like it's almost too much orange for this house. So I definitely wanted to do like a little bit more cream colors and like beiges because that's really fall and like yellows. Okay, we'll go back to my eyes after. My favorite foundation, Patrick, or not Patrick, I always say that, Pat McGrath, Pat McGrath my favorite. And so what I use is this brush right here. This is actually the tapered powder brush. Uh, you can use it for foundation. You can use it for anything. Like I said, my brushes are always multi-use, but I love it because you can get really great like foundation underneath the eyes. And I usually put foundation underneath there and then go in with concealer. Then I don't need as much concealer, but yeah. So I am about to work on my next vlog though, which is going to be, I want to do a little bit of like a fall wardrobe video. Uh, bye bye. <laughs> there we go. Um, you guys, I know it. We're <laughs> Sometimes I'm like, I'm too open, but that's okay. Go over my lips. My lips are so dry right now. I feel like foundation completely changes my whole appearance sometimes. I'm just like, oh, I love it. Couldn't imagine not wearing liquid foundation. There we go. But yeah, I'm gonna get into like my fall wardrobe. I'm so excited, I have so many nice like, I feel like fall is my favorite wardrobe and I get asked the most questions on like where my sweaters are from and like my boots and my beanies and stuff. So I really love fall fashion. I'm like a huge fall fashion person and I can't wait to take like really cute photos with the girls and you know how I love taking beanie photos in the fall so we're gonna actually try to go to a pumpkin patch maybe within the next like few weeks with the girls that would be really really cute where are you concealer 
too much in here. Aha! Found it. And I just have my little Estee Lauder makeup bag or concealer. This one's my favorite, Pat McGrath as well. Okay, so I think I'm gonna fast forward a little bit right now so I can just get ready and then show you guys what I did with the rest of the house and we can work on the coffee bar. So that is my go-to fall look and I just love like the warm colors uh, and I am gonna go put my wig on right now too I had it on yesterday but I'm gonna put it on again today I just feel like I like get things done and I'm like ready to work when I fully get ready and I'm trying to make it a habit to just like spend 10-15 minutes getting ready in the morning and then I'm ready throughout the day and it's just so much easier that way and I don't have to like rush after so just making it a habit and it's working out pretty good Okay, so getting a little better about or putting this on kind of takes getting used to, but there we go. And then braid, I go this way. And then what I do is I just, so it looks a little bit more natural. I pull hair through it. So it kind of looks like an actual braid. So that much. A little knotted from the birthday party but uh, there we go okay go on one side and voila all done so that literally just took me a few minutes to do and I just love how quick and easy this is like it's pre-curled you can style it yourself but these are just by far the best and nicest wigs that I've ever owned so and the hairline i feel like looks so good you can i would recommend buying the tape so you can buy tape from freedom couture and then put like a little piece of tape right here if you're worried about it going back but if you buy uh the braid it actually holds your hair into place so if you're worried about it like shifting or moving this really secures it down so i really do like that if you're looking to get a wig i just thought i would say that but i am gonna go downstairs and work on the coffee bar and show you guys what i did yesterday Look at this little guy. Hello, my papa. Do you have fun playing with your sisters? <laughs> I know they're in, they're having their nap, but at least you have your bears. So sleepy. Honestly, this is the cleanest I have ever seen our kitchen since the girls' party. Uh, so I did a lot of cleaning yesterday and we actually had the podcast. We were sitting right here. Uh, so I just wanted to have like a clear island and I kind of moved things around a little bit. So I got rid of the old pumpkins. They were kind of fading. And then I put a little candle right here, uh, which I just think looks pretty nice. It's pretty simple, but I wanted to kind of keep the kitchen simple. And then I will show you guys. Oh, of course there's toys on the floor now. <laughs> So I just had to put the blinds down because it's so bright in here right now. We haven't put up all the uh, dining room chairs from downstairs, so I have to grab them from the basement. Uh, but I wanted to just quickly show you what I did. I put the placemats down. I filled this with all the fall decor, the little pumpkins, leaves, and everything like that. It's just in a gold bowl. I've got this candle from last year, sand and fog. And um, I've got this really neat pumpkin I got at HomeSense. I have another bowl filled, and I put the Tom Ford 
book back out on the dining room table. So I don't know, it's not finished yet. I would like to get some like nice plates and stuff that we can just leave out. Uh, and I don't know, I don't know what else it needs, but I feel like it needs something else. So uh, that's what I have so far, just from the stuff that we have had from last year. And my office. So I finished this yesterday and it's not like 100% finished, but I just wanted to put stuff away, get this organized. So I just thought I'd quickly show you. So this is just what it looks like right now. I have all my candles right here. I feel like I need to get a few more fall candles. I put the pumpkins here because they actually didn't look good in our kitchen. So I don't know where I'm going to put those yet. And then um, I filled this with brushes, which I already showed you guys. But yeah, just like really organized in here. And yeah. Okay, so that is 100 times better. I basically organized these for the mugs that I use the most. I put in the front and then like holiday collection mugs I put in the back. Bottom rose Ryan's and then the upper ones are Mama's. And right here, I just thought I'd leave the red wine and make it kind of like a wine and coffee area. And uh, then we don't have to go downstairs. Uh, I have all my David's teas. We have all our coffees. We clearly have room for like, I don't know, maybe a nice piece of decor here. And then I put candles up here. I could probably get another few rows of candles or put like a little pumpkin or something. But I definitely need uh, home sense trip because I think like the little areas that I'm wanting to like put decor in I don't have right now So I just think that'll look good, but I definitely cleared out space I think that looks so nice and then over here. We have like my fancier mugs These are actually like the mugs that I use all the time that you see in my stories. So like all the white ones and then on this side here, we're just washing the rest of those we have Ryan's mugs at the bottom and Yeah, that is basically it our coffee machines right here and we're big coffee drinkers so I definitely wanted to like organize this and make sure that it's just like clutter free because it was a little bit of a disaster before so yeah glad I did that and before I end this vlog I also wanted to do for Monday's video share with you some of like my favorite fall fashion and I actually don't have any of my fall boots out so I have to go get all my fall boots put them in here um, except for the dirty ones of course those ones will go in the mudroom uh, or the downstairs closet but I just thought I would kind of get into fall wardrobe so if you guys are wanting to see like a try on outfits definitely let me know in the comments down below and if there's anything else that you'd like me to do I know so many of you want me to do like an in-store shop shopping haul. Uh, so I'll see if I can go to Home Sense maybe sometime this weekend. Uh, but yeah, I do have like my mom's night out on Saturday, so we'll see. But I'm really excited to obviously get into fall content and just share with you all of my fall favorite things. So thank you guys again for watching this vlog. And I feel like I did a ton of cleaning and organizing, especially after the girls party. This house was just madness. All right, so that was today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. And I feel like I got a lot of cleaning done. Our kitchen actually looks normal now. Our dining room is back to normal as well. And coffee bar, I kind of want to get some new decor pieces. Let me know what you think would look good in there. But I always thought it'd be nice as like a little candle and coffee wine bar. But let me know if there's like certain decor that I should get for in there. But I think it'd be nice to kind of decorate that a little bit. We're always in there. We make coffee and we're just like coffee fiends. So. It just makes sense to have it look nice. 
Uh, but yeah, today was just honestly a crazy busy morning and even trying to find the time to film in between Ryan, you know, mowing the lawn and everything like that. There's obviously so many distractions, but right now the girls are down for nap. I have so many new things on the website that I'm working on, new launches. Um, so it's going to be another busy week, but I'm really excited. I have some new fall videos that I have planned. Uh, so probably tomorrow I'll start, start filming for Monday's video, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching today's vlog. And of course, let me know if there's anything that you would like to see in specific. Specific. I know fall is just a time when people I think watch YouTube videos honestly the most I know I have been right when the girls go down I start watching videos and also Netflix so that's been really nice and just relaxing with like a cup of tea uh, but yeah I feel like just like the warm and cozy months are ahead of us and I know there's a lot of comments a lot of you are summer fans as well and you don't want it to be fall but I honestly I love fall so much and it's like before winter I'm not about you know minus 30 weather I honestly am not excited for that but I really really do just like like the warm big sweaters and cozy boots and I'm just so excited for fall so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed that and of course I will see you guys in my next video but make sure you subscribe if you haven't so we could hit 300k before Christmas that's my goal uh, but yeah I hope you guys have an awesome week and I will see you guys on Monday <laughs>